I'd like to say a few more words about the uh, tragedy uh, that struck Thomas Lee Bridegroom and uh, Shane Pitney Crone. Uh, I, I mean, my first comment was made, I was really uh, reeling in emotional turmoil interviewing his uh, Mr. Crone's video, It Could Happen to You. Uh, so now I, I'd like to offer a more, uh, more or less impassioned comment, also having had time to investigate, try and piece together, I get a, a full picture of what happened and uh, uh, and since learning that uh, yes uh, enough money was raised to uh, fund the, the the documentary uh, bridegroom in American love story so that's uh, that's great that's wonderful I I made a donation and encouraged others to do so and uh, so from what I uh, learned uh, it's pretty much as uh, mr. Crone put it in his, his uh, video. A tragic accident it took the life of uh, Mr. Bridegroom and uh, following that Mr. Bridegroom's family proved to be very uncharitable. Uh, but still uh, having said that uh, and also uh, since then learning that uh, various uh, news gathering organizations, I think CNN was one of them, uh, approached the bridegrooms to ask if they'd like to comment, give their side of the story, but uh, uh, they uh, they refused to comment, and that's fine. Uh, they, they are under no obligation to say anything, and it uh, should be added that their right to privacy should be respected, because uh, lest we forget, they lost their son too. At any rate, uh, oh, I took the opportunity to watch some of the, the videos that Messrs. Uh, Bridegroom and, and Crone left of, of, like, their life together and, uh, <laughs> well, seeing that, uh, my tears turned to smiles, seeing how happy they were, were together. And, what a delightful sense of humor Mr. Bridegroom had, and as does Mr. Crone. Um, oh. <laughs> Still chuckle. <laughs> yeah, but uh, yes, it, uh, they were a very happy and loving couple, and it's really tragic. Mr. Bridegroom came to such an untimely end, but uh, it's great that uh, now the whole world, because of the efforts of Mr. Crone, will know who he was and who it was he, he loved. And uh, certainly gave me and, and probably many others a, a good swift kick in our complacency and stop taking our uh, marriage or relationship for granted as my spouse and I uh, made sure to go over our, our legal and business affairs make sure everything's in order even though here in, in Canada uh, gay marriage is, is legal and, and uh, even our common law relationship has the same legal standing as a, as a heterosexual couple but still you can't be too careful uh, it's uh, you know, it still resonates. Uh, I mean, even though these men are strangers to me, it, it, uh, you know, Mr. Crone is right. It could happen to you, and uh, mm. so I say to those of you who are like me, I mean, relationships, savor every minute you have together and, and make sure 
uh, and protect yourselves in, in case the unimaginable should happen. And, uh, personal comment to, to Mr. Crone, Shane, in case you should happen to watch this. Uh, you have a delightful sense of humor and a charming smile, and I'm, uh, it's ever so much nicer seeing you smile than in tears, so I hope, despite your loss, that you'll be able to get on with your life and still find joy and happiness, and uh, thank you for sharing your most poignant story, and uh, I look forward to viewing the, the, the uh, film when it's released, uh, so again, I'll conclude saying, life is good. <laughs> <laughs>